Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm gonna be doing these Woo braids, pop smoke inspired braids. Well, actually mine are kind of inspired by Bernice. I'm gonna insert a photo of her with them. That's why I made them jumbo and a little bit longer than usual. But yeah, I'm feeling them. This is my first time trying to do feed-ins or any type of braids on my head i've never done it so i don't know what i'm doing but anyways let's get into the video oh and disclaimer the first half i had on a different shirt and i have on this pink shirt so yeah <laughs> Hello guys, welcome back to my channel today we are doing woo braids pop smoke inspired braids and this was actually the struggle you're gonna be seeing the real the raw struggle with me trying to braid my own hair like this was literally so hard i did not know what i was doing i thought i was gonna fail but they ended up looking good especially the second day once i laid it down but this is me trying to part it i didn't do full in-depth tutorial of me parting but if you do want my parting videos i will upload them for you guys and yeah, so this is me trying to part my hair. I was really tempted not to um, straighten it because I really just want to show you guys that you can do all these really cute styles without heat. Yeah, sometimes they might look better with heat, but to maintain our curls and, you know, me transitioning into this curly natural life, I'm trying not to use heat. But I really wanted to because whoo, that kitchen in the back. Just wait till you see that kitchen in the back. Y'all are going to scream them BBs. Moving on to the products, I have Murray's Edge Wax, Edge Boosters, the Wax Stick, and the edge control and then i have queen bees braiding hair i actually found some here in my city a lot of you probably won't find anything because we're in quarantine but i found some and i actually used eight bags and i didn't think i was going to use that that many but thankfully four in each thing was six dollars so i only sp spent like 12.99 on both of them so all together so that was great inexpensive hairstyle took me about three hours to do because like i said i kept restarting and restarting and restarting i was pretty satisfied with the ending results i kind of wanted to go back and fix some of them but i couldn't i was tired so first things first you want to lay your edges before you start braiding because like it's hard to pull edges out of those braids so i just laid them first and i'm actually going to do this whole side or well, most of the side off camera and i'm going to come back when i get to the back of my hair so you can see one in the back and then you can see the other side
excuse my brother i don't know why he came in here but anyways i'm gonna break this down and we're gonna be moving on to the back like i said so doing the back was like the hardest part and the back is so thick back there and there's so much hair to braid so i didn't really add a lot of hair into that i'm just gonna let you guys watch because i am a visual learner that's how i learn um yeah so that's actually how i did the style i just looked at one video and i was like oh i got this <laughs> even though i really did it so just watch this back side and when we get to the front i will try to explain everything in as much detail as possible Moving on to the other side, so this is where I struggled because I'm like, okay, I want them to be similar sizes, so I have to start off braiding. I probably braided twice, and then I took a small piece, and then I sh went straight into the big pieces I did not hold back, and I didn't try to make the pieces like too, too big, but medium. It's really hard to explain. I feel like you might need to watch a feed and braid tutorial before you watch this video because girl I do not know how to feed and braid for real I could do it like on other people but my hair no 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 so just watch this and this is me just ripping the hair apart as you can see I'm not taking jumbo jumbo pieces but kind of medium kind of medium big medium Wait, that's small. What's medium and big? Smig. It was smig.
Watch this, y'all. Yeah, keep braiding. Oh, never mind. See how I'm braiding first and then I have to like feed it in a little bit? That's how Bernice's looked. Other people's, it's like they started feeding it in at first. Am I gonna am I gonna be satisfied with this one, you guys? You think I am? Let's see, cause I'm feeding it in. Oh, did I keep that one? Oh, is this a winner? I don't think I'm gonna keep that. That's kind of ugly. I don't think. Yep, I knew it. That wasn't cute. <laughs> you could tell the frustration in my face like i was so irritated i'm like come on i just want to look cute take pictures i don't feel like doing all this hair stuff i think this one's the winner or maybe i'm oh no look y'all it literally took me so long i think this one might be a winner because i think i was sick and tired so literally i just Feed the hair into my middle finger and my thumb, and then I just start braiding. Wait, I'm lying. Well, you want to grab it with your middle finger and your thumb, and then with your other hand, you just start start off braiding or whatever. That's how I do it. Your middle, or is that your pointer finger and your thumb? I don't know. Y'all gonna have to watch a braiding video. It might be your pointer finger and your thumb. And then with your other finger, you take it over. Start braiding. But yeah, that's this one. I hope y'all learned something from this. And please do not uh, cuss me out in the comments or nothing. I'm sorry. kept adding these little pieces at the bottom for length because I wanted them to be long Bernice's were down to her butt so that's what I wanted mine that's how long I wanted mine to be down to my butt you know we love long hair so here I go with the second one I'm only gonna show a little bit like the starting of it just so you guys can see one more time if you need to rewind replay that last part back where i was feeding it in to my pointer and my thumb go ahead and rewind that but this is probably the end of me talking because i know that i talk too much and i don't want to bore you guys so hopefully you guys do this style on yourself and it looks just as bomb or better because i did i know what i was doing and send me pictures on my instagram so that i can see how good you guys look at Tasia Shamari.
one more thing y'all do not burn your hair i don't know why i did that i listened to my mama when i did that you want to dip your ends i don't know why i didn't just go with my gut thank you guys for watching this video make sure that you like comment and subscribe and stay tuned for my next video